Hi YouTube and welcome to the Frugal Radio channel. Today I'm just going to do a very quick video to introduce you to a new plugin for SDR Sharp called Simple DMR. It will get you up and running and decoding DMR signals in no time at all. Let me show you how it's done. So if you follow the link on the website, it will take you directly to the relevant plugin page. Uh, you'll see here I have Google Translate running because the site is in Russian and, uh, and it always translates Russian to English. Then I just click on the download button and here it is. I downloaded a copy earlier on so now I actually have two copies of it. And, uh, and then we can open that file. There's actually not much in the zip file. We'll close down the web page. We do not need that anymore. But what I need to do is go to my STR Sharp folder. So this is the current version of STR Sharp that I'm running. And we will go into the DMR zip file here. We'll see that there's actually three uh, files. So what we want to do is copy the DLL files into the STR Sharp folder. Okay, so those are the two DLL files there. Then we need to add a line into the plugins. So we click on the magic line text, we highlight, control C, and then we go to the plugins file down here somewhere. P comes before, so we do, oh, actually I need to open that with uh, a text editor. So I'm just going to open that with Notepad++ and I can then add it in here wherever I want it to go. So I, you know, I, I'm actually going to put it near the top. Why not? So we'll install it. Oh, just go back. Oh dear. Um, to add key, we'll just go here. Put in an extra line. Control V to paste in the um, DMR plugin one. Hit Control S to save the plugin's XML file. We can then close that. Theoretically now, once we load SDR Sharp, we will have the DMR plugin installed. So let's actually see what happens when it loads. Okay, let's make this a little bigger. So I know there's a repeater on 7375, so I'm just going to change the step size to 12.5 kilohertz here. Just makes it easier to get to the frequency that I want to get to. Uh, the there's a, something happening there. So if we go to the simple DMR plugin, we're ready to switch that on when we encounter another DMR transmission. So 7375. Maybe I'll turn the contrast down a little bit. And uh, all we have to do now is just wait and uh, see what comes through. So I'm not running DST. The only thing I'm running right now is the SDR Sharp with the simple DMR plugin. So this is probably the quickest way to start monitoring DMR right from within SDR Sharp and demodulating the audio. So there you have it. Simple DMR. Simple indeed, easy to install, easy to use, and will get you listening to DMR signals using SDR Sharp very quickly indeed. So what do you think of the plugin? Try it out and why not fill in the comment section below and tell us how it worked for you. Were you able to start receiving DMR signals quite easily with SDR Sharp? How did you find the installation process? And do you prefer something like simple DMR over a more lengthy process that's involved in setting up something like DSD Plus that was recently featured in episode 7 of the 2020 SDR Guide? 
Thank you for joining with the video today at any rate. Hopefully you have found it helpful. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, then please go ahead and do that now. I'm grateful for every single subscriber. And it really actually helps out if you can hit the like button as well, if you have found this video to be something that you like. It lets me know the kind of content that you enjoy, and it allows me to make more videos that are in keeping with that sort of content. As always, thank you for joining with Frugal Radio today. We'll see you again next time. This is Frugal Radio saying over and out.